as a kid, I used to, uh, my, my grandfather has a few farms and a few orchards, um, small personal like family orchards. And, and I used to go there and work and I didn't really appreciate that or know what it was like until I grew up in, in other places, cities and urban environments. And I, I missed that because it was, uh, it was really riveting to be like outside and my feet in the mud, all of that. Uh, so I feel like I lost touch with nature growing up. And then um, when I came to Pennsylvania, I started to go outside and see natural places and parks. And it got me more involved with trees. I started seeing them as, as living beings. And, and I wanted to care for them. And they have a very common presence. And, and that's the kind of presence I want in my life. We, in, in, in Temple Ambler, were able to go outside and see the subjects, see the plants, work with them. Uh, really experience what it's like to be a horticulturalist. First of all, the, the campus is in an arboretum. So definitely being able to experience the plants. I'm a visual learner and I, I, I learn through touch and through feel, through, through being there. So uh, being able to see the plants was very helpful. Being able, having very kind um, professors, uh, some with very unique um, personalities that kind of uh, allow you to, to to understand how the plants live rather than just view them as biological subjects. So it, it, it was kind of very helpful to have that. And the, the, um, the arboretum is placed in different uh, environments. It's not one or another. There's wetlands, there's prairies. So there's all kinds of environments that we could actually experience in this little campus of ours. I guess what I found most helpful was that when I uh, started here, I started in the spring semester, so it, it wasn't, um, it wasn't like a typical term or a typical year where you start in the fall. So we had a special kind of orientation for international students where a bunch of us, a bunch of international students were housed together for a little while, uh, for a couple of weeks before um, the semester started. And we got to, they showed us places and where to go and how to navigate and took us to Ikea and places like that. And, and that was really helpful to transition because before then I hadn't been like without a family of my own. So it was very helpful to have that. I've always seen the flower show, um, like the work that's been done for it, but never been involved with it until now. And it was it was very gratifying to start plants from scratch, you know, how to, how to train them, have a vision, and then to take it out and build it and make it like a real thing. Um, and then on top of that, I got to speak to people. A lot of people spoke to me and uh, they asked questions and I was very, uh, it was it was very satisfying to have that experience, and I even got to do an interview on native plants with um, with a YouTuber uh, who has a native plants channel. Uh, so yeah, it felt um, made me really realize how much I've learned over the years. Uh, so I want to have my my hands in different places. I want to work with uh, uh, permaculture, um, so sustainable farming, and uh, but also um, landscape restoration. Um, I want to do some, some studying of plants too, not necessarily in the lab, but just, you know, first, uh, hands-on experience and that's the best way to learn. I even want to work with mushrooms and, and try to grow them and mm -hmm. yeah. So really anything that can help, um, restore ecology to what it once was. This job is in Doylestown. It's a somewhat, uh, agrarian area, um, which is great, uh, easier to breathe there. Um, and they do landscape restoration, as I've mentioned, and that's something that I've been passionate about, just restoring the land to a state that, uh, where the ecology can function and all aspects in it are integrated. Um, so it feels like gratifying work. It's hard work, um, but it's, it's very gratifying. Uh, I'll say it's an experience you won't regret. Philadelphia is beautiful. Hamler is beautiful. Um, the people are very kind. Um, it, I feel like, and there's so much history here that I feel like it's one of the best places uh, to, to, to go to and, and, and kind of experience a different culture entirely. And I'd also take it, say, um, take it easy because it's uh, just in general, whatever the major is, uh, because there's no point of stressing over anything. Mm -hmm.